Hey guys, today is the two year anniversary of my channel. Barry, release the balloons! Oh yeah, I don't have a berry. <laughs> oh well, that's okay, but yeah, today is actually the two year anniversary of this particular channel. I was amazed because people were sending me emails about it. And thank you guys so much, we've come so far in just two years. We're almost at two and a half million subscribers and making that progress in such a short amount of time. Well, it seems short to me, but it's two years is a long part of my life. But just thank you guys for supporting me all the way through this. And, you know, it's not the official two year anniversary of the time I've been on YouTube. I actually had a channel before this one that got closed down because of various reasons with YouTube and AdSense and all that unfunny, entertaining stuff that I don't like to talk about anymore. But uh, still, it's, it's, a, it's a moment to celebrate and just to thank you guys again for all that uh, you've done for me. And, and I know that I thank you guys a lot, but I just really enjoy the uh, opportunities that you've given me and I, I want you guys to always know that I'm always grateful. So I'm gonna keep saying it, no matter how annoying it gets to you guys, I am super grateful. Also, I was reminded of my old channel very recently because I was just on Scare to Care, which is a show uh, that's a yearly charity show run by Vernon Shaw and his brothers and a whole bunch of other YouTubers joined, where we raise money for Camp Kassam, uh, which is for children with cancer and it's a very great charity and I was happy to be a part of it and thank you guys so much for the last minute arrival to that and you still blew away all expectations just thank you to everyone who donated to that cause I was only there for three and a half hours but we still raised fourteen thousand dollars and that's with me not giving you guys any warning about it so thank you guys so much but I mentioned casually on the show that I had a channel before I have this channel right here uh, where I played a bunch of other games and I, I tried different things and I didn't know who I was as an entertainer just yet um, and before that I was actually doing a Minecraft series on what I had Markiplier 1 and Markiplier 2 so I have this whole set of videos of this entire playthrough of Minecraft that I did 53 episodes 10 minutes and longer some of them are like 20 minutes of just me totally crapping out on Minecraft and being awful at it and being awful at commentary and, and a lot of people send me emails about it saying that they wanted to see it they actually wanted to see my terrible terrible Minecraft playthrough maybe you guys will find it entertaining but there was enough people that wanted it that I actually uploaded every single video and there is a secret unlisted playlist that can only be accessed through the link in the description below I don't even think I can annotate an unlisted playlist but it is down there the link is there and the only way you can get to all 53 episodes of young Markiplier fooling around and not knowing what the hell he's doing is through that link so if you really want to see it feel free to watch it feel free to make fun of how I was before feel free to go oh you was just a little baby and he was adorable and didn't know what he's doing so it's there for you guys to enjoy please do um, it's a blast from the past and I think it's kind of appropriate being that this is my two-year anniversary of the channel So just thank you guys so much for uh, getting me to this point because I've developed as a person and as an entertainer since then And it, it's always good to look back on uh, certain things and I'm actually working on a mine uh, Markiplier highlights right now That is uh, almost entirely older videos and it's crazy to see myself back then in those days It's just kind of weird to watch myself back then kind of go like ooh, is that funny I don't know if that's funny but still it's good to be in touch with who I was because I've always felt it's important to be grounded especially after coming this far so just know that I haven't forgotten the past you know I just try to be better every day but at the same time I know that a lot of people really think that my old stuff was the best stuff so uh, with this series and the Markiplier highlights that are coming out later this week I really hope you guys understand that you know, I haven't forgotten about the past, and you know, I haven't forgotten about the time when we were a smaller channel, and, and just that closeness of the community and that community that I really want to build is so very important to me, and, and I hope it's important to you guys. And the website's coming. I'm working on that right now. It should be just two more weeks here. It'll be up and ready for you guys to use. Forums, I'll have a blog there. We can share a whole bunch of stuff. It'll be ready to go, so thanks for that. Oh, and speaking of Minecraft, I had some good news because I recently got together with Wade, Bob, and Zombie Mold, and a few of Zombie Mold's admins on the server that he runs, and we are bringing back Drunk Minecraft bigger and better than ever. I know that the fan community around Drunk Minecraft is massive, and you guys are so dedicated and I'm so unbelievably appreciative of what you guys have done to support me in that show it's one of my oldest running shows 
And we are bringing it back bigger and better than ever while still maintaining the core aspect of it, which is just three friends dicking around, blowing stuff up. But it's gonna be even better because there's gonna be multiple admins behind the scenes that are uh, working as we are recording to mess with us and basically ruin everything that we try to do. Not that we did anything anyway. Anyway. <laughs> Not that we did anything anyway. And hopefully it'll be an ever And hopefully it'll be an even better experience. So there's gonna be like four cameras running in the background. I'm gonna spend way more time editing them. They're gonna be um, just a bigger event and the fans are going to be involved in episodes. That's right, we have actually recorded, uh, done some test recordings where we actually had fans playing with us and we want to get you guys involved because the community has been so awesome. We want this show to be as much yours as it is, as it is ours. So we're gonna have a lot more information on how you guys can get involved with the show and it's gonna be so amazing. So thank you guys for your amazing support. Amazing, can I say amazing more? It's amazing! There's one more thing I wanted to talk about and something I was supposed to make a video about about two weeks ago. Um, some of you may have noticed that my stuff is in the most recent loot crate. Yeah, oh, that's upside down. Loot crate! My stuff is in the most recent loot crate and I know what the hell I'm doing. And I failed to mention it to you guys and that's where I dropped the ball because um, the stuff that's in here is no longer available in the future ones. But I just wanted to show you guys what was available so that you could see and hopefully you guys aren't mad at me too much, I'm sorry. So let's get this open! <laughs> Okay, so anyway, Loot Crate, if you don't know what it is, it's this monthly subscription service that uh, allows you to get a box full of probably more than what it costs worth of stuff. And I've already seen what's in it because I've seen other people uh, celebrate what's in it. And there's this really cool t-shirt uh, that has Link and it says, a courageous soul. It's got a whole bunch of words. I love these word art um, things like this where it's just a character that's built out of words. Like someone did this of my face and it, it was oddly weird, but that was a long time ago and I really loved it. It was very well done. All slogans that I've said in the past. But anyway, the subscription service is like, I think it's uh, 13 37 per month base price. And each month you get a box like this. And usually if you buy a t-shirt like this, you may even pay 20 bucks. So it might be worth it already. Um, I don't even know what this, oh, Oh, Minecraft anger. Hey! What are you doing over there? Wake up! Wake up! I need the backlight, rim light on my beautiful hair. So anyway, we got Minecraft hangers in here. It says each pack contains one hanger, so I don't know what this is. I guess I can find out. And... Oh God! It's a, it's a piggy zombie. It's a oh, that's adorable. Creepy because he's a zombie and dead and wants to kill me, but still that's adorable. Staring into my soul. Anyway. Moving on, you got, whoa, what is this? Oh, it's some Cartoon Network thing. Is this, oh, it's a it's an Adventure Time Duty Daddy thingy. I know exactly who this character is. His name is Gunter, and he's a penguin on a TV show called Adventure Time that a lot of people like and would be mad if I didn't know about. So, anyway, wait, that's not Gunter. I have no idea who this I know exactly who this is as well. This guy's Potato Butt. He's Potato Butt the cat and a lot- Oh god. No! I broke it! I broke Potato Butt! Why?! Well, so Potato Butt is definitely okay and not broken and I shouldn't be given nice things because obviously Gunther doesn't know what happened to Potato Butt in there. We're just gonna pretend like that didn't happen. Right, everybody? Nothing saw anybody to do one. Anyway, so we also got, ooh, is that a bottle opener? Hell yeah! I love bottle openers. Not many people know, but I used to be a bartender. Actually, probably a lot of people know because I talk about it all the time. But I used to be a bartender. How cool is that? If I could just get it. There it is. You guys probably saw it through the plastic, but I got it out because I can. There's also a button that says Loot Crate Adventure. A lot of people like buttons, especially at conventions. They collect them or something because they're usually free. Anyway, here's the main course of the attraction. Captain Sparkles! Me! So anyway, yeah, there were Markiplier tattoos in here and I've seen a lot of pictures of people uh, who have these tattoos on and I'm gonna actually try to put these on right now on my face. Here we go! So, I'll be right back. Oh, I shouldn't have cut the instructions in half. Has it been 30 seconds yet? 
The sun will come out tomorrow. Bad your bottom dollar. Bad your bottom. Alright, it's probably done. Okay, I'm gonna assume it's done. So, shabam! I won't actually know if this is actually done until way later, so I'm just gonna assume because it's gone there that it's actually on my face. So, hooray for that happening. Now, the next one! The sun will come out tomorrow. Oh, this hurts my throat. Ooh, that's a nice sound. The I'm sure that this is gonna work perfectly. Well, my users believe in me. But it really is a weird sound. I'm Batman. I'm Batman with a weird thing on my forehead. So no one, please ignore me. Make sure it's nice and damp. Not many people know, but that's how I actually warm up in the mornings. This is a nice hard dick. Ugh. Did it work? Okay, so I have no idea if it actually worked, so... Hooray, Markiplier tattoos! Let me see pictures of you in more inconspicuous locations than this. Maybe not. Don't do that. There's actually a lot of Polaris channels that are featured in the Loot Crate this month, and it's really cool to see because um, Captain Sparkle's got stickers, there's a Friend Zone soundtrack, and there's a whole bunch of other symbols stickered here, and I'm actually got another sticker again, so I'm actually really proud because, uh, like, I was featured two times, I guess Captain Sparkle's also featured. We didn't have a tattoo. So go on that! So anyway, it's just really cool to see that all these uh, YouTubers are featured in the crate. And if you don't know what Loot Crate is, I think I described it enough. And with showing this, hopefully you guys will know what it means. But uh, there's a link in the description below where you can get a 10% discount on a new subscription or something like that. I hope it's still valid because once again, I, I want to say that I am late to the party on this one. And hopefully you guys can still take advantage of it if you haven't heard of it already. So, obviously the stuff in this crate is worth more than the price you pay. So, give it a look. Let me know what you think. And as always, I will say, no, not time for that yet. I need to look like less than an idiot. Ah! Alright, so thanks again, Loot Crate, for having my stuff in the box. You guys can check the link in the description. As you can see, it's definitely worth more than the price you pay, which is probably 13 bucks. Uh, they have discounts for actually signing up for more months, so it's an even better deal. Um, if you guys like what you see, obviously link in the description. But do what you want. It's your life. I can't make you do anything. Let me look at me. I'm an idiot. So with all that being said, thank you guys again for an amazing two years. I don't know when I'm ever going to quit YouTube, but I don't have any plans anytime soon. In another two years, I imagine myself sitting in front of a camera for you guys acting like a moron. So thanks again, everybody, so much for watching. I hope to make this the best year possible. I've already got the next charity live stream planned. That's going to be an official one that I'm running. And I've got a special new item that is not a shirt that I know you guys are gonna absolutely love. So thank you guys so much for everything that you've done to support me. I can't wait to see what we do in the next few years. So thanks again. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye! Can I get an Bye! Can I get one? Come on, me! Come on, me! Oh, I tore my own up. Bye!